Hello there. In this video, I'm going to show you how to access the Google Analytics sample data sets within BigQuery. The sample data sets are a fantastic resource for anybody who wants to start exploring and familiarizing themselves with the Google Analytics data in BigQuery. Google has made two different sample data sets available for free, which you can access through the BigQuery public data sets. The first is an e-commerce data set, which includes data collected from the Google Merchandise Store, which is an actual online store selling Google branded merchandise. The second is a gaming app data set based on an actual game called Flood It, which you can download on the iOS or Android stores. Both data sets are based on the GA4 data schema. Some of the data has been masked or modified for privacy reasons. So as you work with it, you may find there are some values missing or some things which look a bit odd, but still they are a great resource that you can utilize to start your learning journey. So the first thing you'll need if you haven't already got one is a Google Cloud platform account. You can sign up for a new account at cloud.google.com. Claim yourself $300 in free credits and a 90 day free trial. Okay, so I'm now on the GCP homepage. First thing I need to do is head over to BigQuery. So I'll open up the menu here, select BigQuery, and then SQL Workspace. Once the workspace is loaded, in order to access the sample data sets, just click Add up here at the top, and then select Star a project by name. And here we're going to type BigQuery dash public dash data and click star. You'll see that a new project has now been added to the workspace. So I'm going to click on the arrow to open that up and then scroll down until I find the data set named GA4 obfuscated sample e-commerce. Click on the arrow to open that one up. And under that, you will see there are some events tables. Let's click on that. And we will now see the table overview page. Here you can see an overview of the table schema indicating all of the field names and the data types. Click on details to see more information about when the table is created, how many rows there are and how much storage space it takes up. You can also click preview here to open up a preview of the data. As I mentioned earlier, there is also another sample data set for an app game. So we can access that in the same way. Just click add up here at the top, star a project by name, then search for Firebase public project and click star. You'll see another project has now been added on the left here. So click the arrow to open that up. The analytics data set is there and within that we've got our events tables. Again, you can see we've got the schema displayed. We can click here to see more details about the table. And again, we can preview the data. The last thing I'm going to demonstrate is how to run a quick query. So click on the query button here and then in a new tab. This will open up a new tab where we can start to compose a new query. You'll see it's already pre-populated the name of the project, data set and table. So we can very simply just specify some column names that we might want to query here. And then click run to generate that data. And that's it. You're now connected to the GA4 sample data sets. So start having a play around with and explore the data. And if you want to learn more, then head over to the website bq4ga.com to learn more.